next thing he offs himself or something and then I feel bad. But if he were to not do that, then, um, <laughs> oh, man, I don't want to give Slick Talk mileage. Buy Slick Talk a new wardrobe because he uses a, he's just blogger person. I don't know what to call him. He's a YouTuber who's desperate to like be one of us. And, um, he has this wardrobe background of his videos that I see on Twitter. I see his stuff on Twitter, not on YouTube even. So he doesn't get paid for me seeing his stuff. And, uh, and I should buy him a new wardrobe. I need, we need to buy him a background, like a few backgrounds. I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna punish Slick Talk, like, just cause he's a bottom feeder, like, YouTuber. What I will do is I'm gonna buy him a new background, possibly a new camera, and maybe a tripod. Just to help him, like, you know, kill them with kindness vibes. But I think definitely we need to buy Slick Talk a new wardrobe or a new background. I wonder if he has enough clothes to, fit, to fill up a wardrobe. Do you know what I mean? Because that wardrobe is very, very like. Very like when I was in the hood, but like struggling. Does he still have the same wardrobe even though he got paid for the fight? And then Slick Talk is a big guy who gets beat down. No, no, no. He can't be talking about how I look. Has he looked in the mirror? He must look into that wardrobe and get into there and hide. Also, why did you guys bring bad news that I hadn't even seen? You guys are the real ones who really hate me. At least Slick Talk speaks his truth. Oh, uh, he has nothing nice to say about anyone talking just because you're a youtuber doesn't mean you don't have to breathe you can breathe in between your sentences breathe use your eyes be emotive otherwise you don't believe anything you're saying so please go send this advice to slick talk for me he can breathe between his sentences he doesn't have to rush and and squeal and like 